Hi, I'm Noelle. And I'm Bradley. And, and welcome, welcome to, to the, the first, first episode, episode of Hive, Hive 2022. 2022. We are so excited to be bringing you the stinging news from the Hive. Today we're going to be talking about the award-winning film Minus One made by students here at Fairview High. That's right. It is going to be showing for free on January 27th and 28th in the FPAC at 7. Yes, it is. And we also have a sneak peek to show you guys a little trailer. I didn't think it would be this hard without her. I don't know why this is happening. I don't know where she is. I'm just... I'm lost. Hey, have you seen Sophie today? No, I haven't. She hasn't what? answered any of my calls, any of my texts, and we're about to lose our streak. Don't worry about it. It's nothing. Well, we're both going through this in different ways. I want to be there for you, but you have to talk to me. I'm just, I'm just stressed. It's school, and the thought of Sophia isn't helping. I hope to see you guys at the free showing on Thursday and Friday. Another very important date to mark on your guys' calendars is the Mountain Man Memorial March. Which is taking place on April 23rd. First Sergeant Turk will tell us more about that. If you don't know me, I'm First Sergeant Turk. Um, I'm the Junior ROTC instructor here at Fairview High School. Uh, I'm also the Raider coach and the Mountain Man Memorial March coach and organizer for Fairview High School. And I'm pretty sure that's what we're here to talk about today. Mountain Man is in Gatlinburg. Tennessee, uh, we go down there and usually we have a educational trip beforehand. We go to the aquarium or whatever, or go to a military type thing or something like that. And then we go to a ceremony. Uh, one of the buildings there, Fairview High School is invited. Uh, we highly encourage it. The Mountain Man Memorial March, they have a mission to honor through action. And what they do is they host a full marathon, a half marathon, a 10K and a 5K run, as well as a weighted march, which honor to action is, they do the march with 35 pound rucks. That's one category of it, which you can run the whole marathon and then a 10K and a 5K has no ruck. Warriors, soldiers, sailors, airmen, marines, spacemen that have given the ultimate sacrifice for us and our way of life. That has really deep meaning for me. Mountain Man is it's a great character building tool. We connect with the Gold Star families. A Gold Star family is a family that has immediate family member, mother, father, sister, brother, son, daughter, etc. that has lost a loved one while on active duty. And you can see First Sergeant for more info or you can visit the website mountainmanmemorialmarch.com. And for our final piece of news, we're bringing back signing day. We're excited to bring the yearbook signing day back to Fairview and uh, we were having conversations this summer and, and one thing that I was uh, really interested in was why we waited until the fall to pass out yearbooks. And this year, unlike previous years, we're going to have books before school lets out for summer. So all of you seniors are going to be able to have your senior yearbooks signed by your classmates before you leave for summer break. Make sure that if you want to order a yearbook to talk to a yearbook member or there's posters all around the hallways that give you your exact directions. We've been working really hard to make this yearbook really good for everyone. We are currently with a new company, so there's going to be a whole brand new look and there's really good things coming. So make sure you order one and you never know in the future you might wanna rewind. While it may not seem important to you right now, being able to look back at your yearbooks later in life is something that I personally really enjoy. Uh, looking at my senior yearbooks or my junior year yearbooks and being able to look back at what people wrote for me, um, the encouraging things that they wrote, uh, I really enjoy that. It, gets, it gives me really great memories to think about uh, of the past um, and my high school experience. One thing that I do want to say is it's important that you buy the yearbooks because if we don't sell our yearbooks, there's no need for us to have a signing day. So if you want to have a signing day, make sure that you buy a yearbook. Thank you, Dr. Jones and Ms. Sanchez for that information. Well, that was fun. Yeah, I hope you guys got your yearbook. Be sure to drink plenty of water for that marathon and be sure to come out and support your students and go see minus one. All right, and always remember to be nice. Be nice. <laughs>